The Prem Master Qinghai International Association Relief News from Myanmar or Burma. <laughs> A severe monsoon rains across Southeast Asia caused flash flooding in the central Magway region. By the first week in November, at least 161 people had lost their lives, with nearly 30,000 affected. Over 2,000 homes were swept away, while government buildings, regional monasteries, roads and some 5,400 acres of croplands were damaged. Conveying all her love and sorrowful prayers, Supreme Master Ching Hai offered 10,000 US dollars in emergency aid, an amount that could obtain 431,000 US dollars in goods purchased in the United States based on the cost of living in Myanmar. She also asked that our association members please go, if possible, to render assistance to the most desperate. Covering their own travel and related expenses of 900 US dollars, our Thai Association members met up with local Burmese Association members on November 7th in the worst affected Pakoku Township, where floodwaters of up to 4 meters covered the roofs of houses. Accompanied by Pakoku Media Group, they visited five of the hardest hit villages, where 121 people had perished, over 2,700 homes were washed away or destroyed, and many roads had been damaged. Our association's relief team distributed cash assistance and shelter materials to 225 families families, as well as informative SOS flyers on the vegan solution to such disasters. They also provided funds to help five schools and their students. In addition, they went to meet a boy they had heard was in need of an urgent operation that his parents could not afford, and provided the funds for his surgery. I am very happy to see you. Thank you very much. Our appreciation, Pakoku Media Group, for your caring assistance as we join in gratefulness for Supreme Master Ching Hai's unconditional love and kindness, as well as the helpful efforts of our association's relief team. Our prayers for the smooth recuperation of the Burmese people's regular day-to-day -day lives and that such devastations may quickly be averted through humanity's kindest stewardship of the earth and all her inhabitants.